So these, the possibility of these quota rents being transferred abroad raises a very interesting question. There's a possibility if the quota rents from the restricted markets are high enough, these excessive profits associated with the protected market could be so high that foreigners would actually prefer, some foreigners, that is the ones who get access to the license, may actually prefer the quota regime to free trade. I'll give an example of this uh, with, uh, with the sugar market in, a, in another, in another um, lecture. Now, another term that you'll often hear associated with quantitative restrictions where the licenses are given away is a voluntary export restraint, or VER. This is, these are less common today, but they, they do indeed sometimes uh, occur where the foreign government or foreign firms agree to limit the amount of product that comes in to the domestic market, essentially restrain the exports, thereby raising the price and increasing the profits to those foreigners who have access to the market. Those that don't have access clearly uh, are made worse off by this. Now, a couple of, if you will, extreme versions of the quota. One of them is a prohibitive quota, basically uh, a, a ban on exports into a country, or a ban on imports, probably should say, where the domestic government says, we are not going to let any of the products come in. So you essentially have uh, an autarky situation for that particular good. Now, if there's a ban on imports from only particular exporters, say because of a an economic sanction regime, then there would be limited effects inside the domestic economy to the extent that other countries, other firms, could substitute for the banned uh, exported goods. And then finally, we have an idea that's called a non-binding quota. That is to say, well, for example, if there were 200 million dollars worth of products coming in and the government said, well, we're going to limit it to 300 million. No clear effects there. The limit, the quantitative restriction, is greater than what is actually being imported. So you wouldn't have necessarily any effects on the domestic market in a, a 